everybody. It's morning, obviously. It's dark outside. Well, maybe not obviously, but it is dark outside. A little after four o'clock in the morning. We got about four, maybe five miles on tap for this morning. So we're just going to get after it. I've been pretty slow getting going this morning. So I need to start moving. Otherwise, I'm going to be running late all day long. So here we go. Join along. All right, guys. Well, there it is. Did four miles today. Kept it in zone two, nice and slow. I am feeling lethargic today. Uh, stayed up a little later than normal last night. Uh, didn't sleep the greatest, you know, on the road. I never sleep that good when I'm in a hotel. So maybe that's just all coming down on me. But yeah, just not feeling the 100% like I normally do when I go running. But this morning it was a little rough, but we slugged through it, got it done time to go back to the hotel bam, and go get showered up and cleaned up and ready to go to work so that's all i got for wednesday guys tomorrow's thursday we're going to do another four or five miles it's kind of like a taper week it's just kind of like a reset and get back into the groove so follow along tomorrow morning and we'll see you then Hey, good morning guys. It is Thursday and this morning it's just going to be a little four mile easy run. Now the whole reason for like a little taper week in the middle of your training is to kind of get a reset on the body, right? So we've built up and built up and built up, but now we're kind of resetting after this week, then we're back into the normal workouts. So taking a little bit of a break in between here is good for the muscle recovery. It's good to like just relax a little bit in your training let the body recover let the muscles recover a little bit because you've been putting them through a lot of work so now we're just kind of letting everything settle back down a little bit next week we get back into it and we start hammering it some more so here we go nice easy four miles going to keep it low and slow get out get back and then hey we're off to class again so we're almost done with this week of training here in tempe and then we'll be back in yuma after that so almost wrapping up this uh three weeks of training down here so here we go guys it's early it's a little after four o'clock time to go get four miles in All right, guys, well, there it is. That was the four miles, uh, not in zone two. I definitely got outside of zone two. Put a copy of the run up over here so you can see what went down. But nice, easy run today. Kind of worked on picking up my heels a little bit, you know, getting my feet off the ground a little quicker. Felt like it anyway. Um, but yeah, like I was saying, taper weeks or rest weeks, you're still putting in mileage. You're not putting in as much volume and you're definitely not going as hard as you normally are during like the workout sessions. So that's what this week is. It's kind of like a rest week, a recovery week. Still getting miles in, but we're not pushing super duper hard. So that's it for Thursday. Time to go get showered up and ready to go to class today. Got today and tomorrow and then whew, we're flying back. Nah, maybe not flying, driving. Who knows, maybe I'll fly really low, who knows? But that is the plan for today and tomorrow and then this weekend uh probably about a five or six mile run on saturday nothing too too crazy so there we go guys happy thursday and we will see you on saturday hey what's up everybody it is saturday as you can see i'm back home Made it back from Tempe, training went great, passed all my tests. I am now recertified and ready to rock and roll with work. So today is Saturday, like I said. It's a little late, it's like 6.30, almost seven o'clock, something like that. So we're gonna get out, get about five miles in. So like I said, this week is just a taper week. We're just kind of letting the legs recover, letting the body kind of recover. Next week, we're gonna come back and hit it hard. So five miles. Um, not really keeping it in any zone or anything like that. We're just going out, probably just going to do an out and back. Just go out two and a half miles, turn around, come back. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. It's Saturday. We don't want to stress the body too much today. Take tomorrow as a rest and then we get back at it next week. So here we go, join along. Alright guys, 
there you go. That was the run. As you can see, the shirt is completely drenched. It is hot and muggy out here in Yuma. Not nearly as bad. Well, it is a, it's worse than Tempe was. Tempe was a lot cooler temperatures. It was a higher elevation, a little cooler. Um, just got tons of humidity this morning out there on the run, but it was a good run all in all. Put a copy of it over here. That way you can see what all was done. I'll also throw in the splits so you can kind of see what I did each mile. Um, kind of hovered around the that 8.30 to 8 minute, 8.45 to 8.15 ish uh, pace. Wasn't really pushing super duper hard. Last mile was a little bit of a strain, but uh, like I said, this, this week was kind of like a taper week, just taking it easy, not doing anything too strenuous. Next week we start back in at the, uh, on the workouts. So look forward to those. But other than that, guys, that's it for this week's uh, video. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it. Don't forget to uh, hit that thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, comment down below. Let me know how your training is going, what you're training for. Uh, if there's anything I can do to help, just comment down below. I'll get back to you. Um, but other than that, guys, thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to run often and run happy. Take care.